What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Astro, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Zatanna premium format from Sideshow. We're going to look at all the pictures, the price point, the edition size, all that good stuff. I'm going to give you my thoughts, then I want to hear your thoughts in the comments. So without further ado, let's do it. All right, here we are. So we have the Zatanna, and just off the bat, I'll tell you that this Satana has guided me back into the Justice League Dark sector, right? So I was debating on if I should do Justice League Dark and Quarter Scale because I didn't want to hunt down the Satana. The previous one, it was kind of, you know, it was cool, but I feel like people were asking for a little bit too much for it. And then you come out with this, right? They, we got this and I was like, okay, absolutely. I'm doing Justice League Dark. We're going to hunt down the Swamp Thing because I love that statue. Unless they do another one, that's going to be better, which it's going to be hard to beat that one. And um, just pray for Constantine <laughs> at this point. I'm just just pray for him. Um, Prime One is doing a, a third scale of Constantine. Hopefully that is going to be popular. The way things are going with statues and prices and stuff like that, I don't think that it will. But that is a very very good statue, and it was received very well by the community. But whatever. We're not here to talk about all that. Let's get into these pictures. So only 17 pictures. We got Satana. Uh, this is the regular version here that we're currently looking at and you know when i first saw this i was really really confused because i was like is she really lame is that what i'm seeing or is that like a trick or something right and um yeah she's actually leaning that's that's pretty cool and i was very very impressed by how she leans the second thing i was impressed by was the sculpt itself she is sculpted beautifully she looks great Look at her look at her face look at her her body everything looks really nice the fishnets are gonna look really cool i think they really knocked this one out of the park. i when i say i can't find anything wrong with this piece i cannot find anything wrong with it there was a lot of rumblings people were talking about how simple the base was how they just kind of did the the mirror at the bottom i thought it played into the actual sculpt and you know added a different element to it right she's leaning how is she doing that you add a mirror you don't see anything underneath obviously right that kind of plays into what's going on here not too big not a huge footprint 12 inches wide nine nine roughly nine inches deep 21 almost 22 inches tall not crazy at all this is one this is definitely a cop um love how they give it like a little blue tint in their hair so a lot of people saying she looks like michael jackson a lot and maybe but i mean <laughs> it still looks good right kind of going in a circle she looks great man this piece looks freaking awesome we're gonna look at the exclusive here look at all those details there in the corset I think that's what it's called looks really nice man this is nice gold tan i think the the, the gold in the blue gives it a little bit of a pop because it's just kind of black and white throughout love the red pop on the shirt on the jacket as well that's really cool Let's look at the exclusive. So, the exclusive, right? You have the demon and coming out of the hat. This doesn't really, um, doesn't really impress me per se. I mean, it's, it's sculpted very cool, right? This is this is very nice. The the paint app on this looks really cool, but it doesn't impress me. If I were to get it, um, which I am going to get it, I would just display it with the um, with the hat and just keep it simple right just keep it really simple exclusive is 600 the collector's edition is 580 currently no edition size uh, announced if I had to say if I had to guess I would say this is probably like 3500 if I just had to if I just had to guess between the two of them 3500 um, I don't think this will, this will be a huge 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 seller like this is not gonna sell 7,000 pieces right but uh, I think 3,000 is going to be the sweet spot, and with 3,350, and um, I'll be I'll be getting this. This will be coming into my collection. This is 1,000% a hit. What do you guys think? Um, again, yeah, I'm, this is not day one. I mean, obviously, it's not day one. This has been out for for a couple weeks now, but I'm gonna get this. I'm probably just gonna put some some money aside whenever it ships and just get it like next year, 2023, whenever it ships, uh, first quarter of next year. And uh, she's gonna come to the collection, man. She's gonna go 
part of my, my DC line, and uh, I'm going to find a way to pick up Swamp Thing. We're going to make it work, man. Just pray for Constantine and go from there. Um, I, I'm not interested. I, I, w I don't think we'd ever see a dead man in Quarter Scale. He's such a niche character. He's not. He's like a maybe like a C-list character. I don't I don't know if Sideshow's willing to invest in those type of characters. I think Exxon would, would be somebody who would do that and um, in Quarter Scale and I mean, he's such he's so low on the total pole. That's such a big risk. I don't I don't know if they do it because I think Dead Man you can actually still get from Prime One, and that tells you something, right? But anyway, um, let me know your thoughts in the comments. Let me know what you guys think. This has been my quick review of this piece. Again, I love it. I'm gonna get it. Let me know you guys thoughts in the comments. Until next time, you guys be safe, and I'll holla at you. Peace.